The following is a class on the Srimad Bhagavatam, fifth canto, sixth chapter, text number ten, given by His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on December twenty eighth, nineteen seventy six, in Bombay, India. The Bandhasam Dharma, that is, beginning of human civilization. So, in this age, they have already given that there is no Bandhasam. In India, it is simply in name, actually, there is no Bandhasam. That the, most of the people, they are Sudras. But without Varnasam, uh, there cannot be any human civilization because the aim of human life is to understand God. That is the aim of human life. <coughs> Unfortunately, they have given up this idea the aim of life is to understand God. You inquire all over the world, 99.9 percent uh, will deny God or they have no clear idea of God. In the so-called religions, they have also no clear idea. Uh, maybe or some power, no clear idea. And now they are, neither they are interested to know. But so far we are concerned, we uh, have got a full description of the Lord uh, and His pastimes, His activities, everything is recorded in the Srimad Bhagavatam and another in Vedic literature. And God says in the Bhakti Bhagavad Gita personally that I was existing in the past and I shall continue to exist in the future. Similarly, uh, the living entities they also existed in the past and they will continue to exist in the future individually. That is stated in the Bhagavad Gita in the second chapter. It is not that we shall be finished in future as there was no existence in the past. No. We are both of us. We are eternal. God, Krishna, and we living entities, we are eternal. Vahannati, Hannavani, Sadire. Our destruction of this material body does not mean we, a spirit soul, we are destroyed. No. To understand this uh, truth, the Bhandasam system requires. Uh, without this Bhandasam system, uh, nobody can understand that we are individual person who existed in the past and we shall exist in the future. And we are existing at present, anyone can understand. There was no change in the past Neither there will be change in the future. Uh, simply we change the dress. Tathādhi ādhara prāpti dhīra sattvamani. This is our self -jarness. This is called ātma tattvagya. Uh, but uh, people uh, in the present day, uh, they are not interested. Apasya-māpata-tattam, 
जावन जिज्ञा सदय आत्म तत्यम परा भवस्तावन अबोध जात जावन जिज्ञा सदय आत्म तत्यम आवार एक्टिविटी दे आर ऑल डिफीट the difference is that you are constructing this huge gorgeous building uh, and another person also constructing another huge skyscraper building uh, so what is the difference the difference is here we are doing on the atma tattva and they are doing for being defeated the material world. That is the difference. Uh, you will find the same activity dealing with stones and bricks and workers, engineers. But one is based on atma tattva and the other is based on without the atma That is the difference. Uh, sometimes bhakti is Uh, observe is uh, similar to the activities of the kormis but there is difference uh, one is bhakti one is going back to home back to god hey and the other is going forward to the hellish condition of life uh, by the same activity this is the technique uh, uh, how it is possible it is possible by practical example it is said in this shastra just like if you take uh, more quantity of milk preparation you get diarrhea but the same milk preparation juga uh, is there it will stop diarrhea both of them are milk preparation one has uh, created the disease diarrhea uh, and another is uh, stopping diarrhea so why chikitsa the so one is uh, by medical process and the other is without any medical process Uh, the medical process is to satisfy this now here the building is being constructed to satisfy this now uh, to satisfy this now and in other places the building is constructed to satisfy senses uh, this is the difference material and spiritual Uh, material means to satisfy one's senses. Nūnam pramatta kuruti vikarma jat indriya pritae āpinoti. Karma means they are working very hard uh, like dogs and hogs. Uh, but the purpose is uh, indriya pritae. Nūnam Pramatta, they are mad. They should not do that. Why mad? Because the karma means you are creating another body. And as soon as there is another body, vihāntara uh, prāpti, so long you have got this material body, he will suffer. Uh, that is the law of nature. Uh, uh, ja, hmm, karmānu vandha. Uh, जावन्न प्रीति मई देवे ताप कर्मानुबंध ये कर्मानुबंध वी कंटिन्यू देर फॉर इन द शास्त्र इट इज रिकमेंडेड जज्ञार्थ कर्म अन्नत्र कर्मबंध न डोंट टैक्ट एनीथिंग एक्सेप्ट फॉर द सैटिस्फैक्शन ऑफ कृष्ण दैट इज कृष्ण कॉन्सियसनेस If you do anything for your sense gratification, that means you are being bound up by the laws of karma. Uh, laws of karma, it is very strict uh, according to the uh, 
modes of activities, purusa uh, prakritistha opi, bhunti karmajan guna. So we should be very much uh, careful not to be afflicted by the karma, uh, karmanubhavda. This is a very uh, delicate task that they do not know what is the importance of the Vannasam dharma. They have broken it. They don't like this. They, they want to say classless society. Classless society cannot be. Uh, even in Russia, the communist country, they wanted to break down the classless society, but they cannot manage. They have now created a manager class and the worker class. Why manager class? Make it classless. Uh, but that is not possible. Therefore, in the society, uh, there must be managers and the workers. Without this, you cannot work. You cannot make, keep any systematic. Uh, for the managers, the, the Vannasam Dharma, the managers, the Brahman and the Kshatriya, and the workers, the Bhushas and the Sudras. And uh, less than that, less than the Sudra, the Chandalas, uh, they are to be fully controlled, Kirata Muna and the Purinda because they do not know the regulatory principle of life. They are called Chandala. Uh, so they are described in this Hastra. Uh, so the Chhatriyas, they used to keep these Chandalas under full control. Otherwise the society would be lost. Uh, unfortunately, there is no Khatriya, there is no Brahmana, there is no control of the Chandalas, and the whole world is in chaotic condition. Uh, uh, so the Krishna consciousness movement uh, is an attempt uh, because the Chandalas majority and we are very minority, but still uh, little portion of good things is still good. And <coughs> large amount of bad things that is bad. That is not good. Uh, so here it is stated the people who are lowest amongst men and builder by the illusory energy. This is builder. What is that builder? They are trying to be happy by material adjustment. Uh, this morning we are discussing of the aircraft. It is very good to fly in the air, but uh, uh, at any moment the whole plane may be crushed and all of them uh, finished. Uh, so this kind of material adjustment will not help us. Uh, this is illusory only. Maya Sukha. Prahlad Maya is regret. Tato vimukha chetasa. Maya Sukhaya bharamud bahato vimura. Any moment everything will be crushed. Uh, this is called Maya Sukha. And still we are wasting time uh, that for Maya Sukha, illusion. Uh, they will not be happy. Any moment everything can be crushed. Uh, and they are busy. Therefore, this modern civilization is most dangerous civilization, soul killing civilization. The human being got the chance of understanding God, but they are uh, being refused by the authorities to understand God. Rather, if somebody wants to understand, he is checked, he is uh, harassed by the uh, name of brainwashing and mind control. Uh, this is Kalimba. Thank you very much.